there. I've got everybody. I got everyone's ports. Will we be seeing a remix all doubles? Yes, sir. Very exciting. The Lodo Marth? How many games do you want to bet before we see a Kirby or Pikachu? Uh, they're looking for uh, for unity. They're looking for a union. Supersonic only doubles. <laughs> that, was, that was so chaotic. Lodo, you okay with that? What? Supersonic only doubles. No. What? Actually, I remember someone talking about Lodo's Marth um, oh, a little, little while back, so I guess it's not as surprising, but it'll be interesting to get to see it in the offline space and see how it goes. <laughs> Naturally, <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Wait, Ooh, you, well, Shears, we'll you got to you gotta see what comments were like right before yeah, that. Josh Brody goes, Naturally, four blowouts in one close game. Nah, I got this like, one. What happened to the sound? Restart, 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 restart. We just lost sound. Oh, we fixed it. Restart, restart. All right, we're good. That counts as a game. <laughs> everyone, lo everyone loses a game. Yeah, negative one. <laughs> oh, and oh. it looks like blue team is already off to a rough start. With Sonic's too fast. What can I say? Yeah, it looks like the players can't handle his speed. But, and they can't yep, seem to SDI out of a Dark Samus' up E either. Yeah, yeah it's best of three. <laughs> no, I have to ask, Arkma, do you know if there are any differences between the Samus' up E? As I've been noticing a lack of DI out of Dark Samus' I up I have e. no idea. All I remember is that, like, for Dark Samus, if she down B, she doesn't lose her jump. And I think she can grab ledge if she's facing away. I don't remember. Oh, so she's just better Samus. I think so. Yeah, why didn't they just name her better Samus? I don't know. But more importantly, we have to see how this game is going. It looks like Blue Team is trying to even the odds with knocking both of Red Team's stocks out of there to make up for the Sonic's SD early on. So the up is harder to DI out of. All right, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you very much, Eddie. I love Sonic uh, back throw. It feels very visceral. Wait, if it's e harder to DI out, why? Ban Samus. <laughs> it's not fair to Samus players. <laughs> Ooh, but will they be able to edge guard Sonic as he is a very difficult character to with all his options and lack of free fall. That was actually really good by Isildur. Um, because of the charge shot there, um, the um, for Sonic holding uh, spin dash, it could, it's going to put him at a fixed distance because he was off stage and far enough away. So if he had not come up to uh, interrupt, he definitely was getting shot. Yep. Oh, and with it taking to 180 for Sonic to lose its stock, so it looks like he's very much trying to make up for his early SD. Ooh, that was interesting. I was surprised to see Lodo make it back, but then Crockett not able to. Oh, but there's a spike there, and just like that, Blue Team's taking the lead. Yeah. The thing about Marth is he has a very strong off offstage game due to the fact that he has a linear recovery at times, but the stall of his neutral B and the speed of his up B can just make it difficult to edge guard him at times. And it looks like, if anything, they're just trying to take advantage of that. Oh, the, e the, the suicide Lodo. down air. And the game is even once again. Will they be able to knock out Dark Samus' other stock early enough? Because it looks like no one has been able to get pressure to a large extent. It's just been too much of a back and forth. Sonic is getting very aggressive at the edge, and I feel that he needs to be careful on that just due to his high percentage. But will he be able to take the stock off Marth? No, he gets an F smash right in his favor as he ran off. Uh, and he's got to be careful, especially since he does not want to leave his teammate in a 2v1 situation. Ooh, Lodo had a very high percent. This but if anything, I feel dangerous. Red Team has to worry about that a lot more just due to Marth's large amount of percentage. Ooh. All right, but able to share the stock. Yep. High percent for Crockett, but he can still stay alive. Ooh, and that was great hit from the bomb to send Dark Samus back onto stage. Yep, and that uh, fair from Sonic hitting the reverse side, so sending him back to stage, but Crockett going to lose his stock. It's all up to Lodo now, and he's dead. The spike. You know, it seems that, so that SD at the very beginning did not hinder Blue Team at all. Sonic was able to return the favor by far. I think he took about six stocks that game. <laughs> I mean, you could have could have seen it on the thing. I, I didn't see it because I was changing the score. Yeah, I think it was five. 
You know, and all things considered, Sonic, like, literally just jumping Will off the cliff. Will we be seeing Crockett and Lodo's patented double DK? It's possible. That's my favorite remix character. Yo, Dark DK when? <laughs> Evil DK. Wait, can I play as the Donkey Kong Bongo's GameCube peripheral? We can, look, we have keyboard set up so we can make that. <laughs> no, I want to play as them in the game. As a character. Yeah. <laughs> well, we've got Mad Piano. Mad Piano bracket win. Maybe as a side bracket. Yeah, but it seems Red Team is very Ooh, much on trying to figure out who they want to use. Lodo and Croc have a variety of characters, so it could be anyone. But I feel like there might be a chance we might see Lodo's um, Samus. See Lodo's Yoshi? Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, we're, ooh. but are we going to see the Samus still from Crockett? Yes, yes we are. Yes, Crockett is a, a very... I'd say very loyal Samus and DK user. Ooh. And DK is not the best at that. They're going to commit. Double. They're going to commit to the remix. Mm -hmm. I think they can do it. It's just very much about halting Sonic's momentum. As he was kind of just running through them the whole time. And Young Link has been just supporting him so well. Ooh, and a nice re-grab from Lodo off the handoff from Crockett. Bah, but he wasn't able to make much of it. Ooh, bad spot. Not able to find the down smash, though. Lodo getting back onto stage. Yeah. Blue team is doing a very good job, I have to say, for both of their teammates. Because Isildur's just pressure as Young Link has been a lot better this set than it was the previous time we saw him on stream. Uh huh. And I, I think I really might be a Jinx, because that's, what, the third time? <laughs> I think. I've praised someone and they died immediately. Ooh, but Sonic is going for the aggressive edge guard. Oh, and he got too aggressive with it. He was facing the wrong way and didn't quite go high enough to get back on the stage. I feel like Red Team, for the most part, did really good in their uh, separate 1v1s there. Ooh, and another Croc stock from Lodo. Not but Crockett's at 119. Can he be stopped? That was actually really scary, but he was able to actually clank with the spring off stage, um, Crockett. So he was able to actually get back. Mm -hmm. Red Team is doing a much better job at holding both their stocks and taking that up smash though gonna take the that offense stock. on this and Lodo keeping young link off stage with that back throw and a nice down air you Ugh. take it you take it 100% mm -hmm. looks like the frogs are turning up this game <laughs> Lodo's doing a much better job of keeping young link in disadvantage so he can't keep supporting his teammate oh my god is the door was just and put that into should a be the blender stock. <gasps> oh nope Poor Isildur just got, like, wombo comboed on that left platform, and he just couldn't get out. Yep, at this point, it feels like Sonic just doesn't know what to do, and that was the last stock. Will we see a nice team combo here? Ooh, nice 11 hits on that. And there's the down air to seal and it. And a very fierce return from red team. Nice pop off there as well from the two frogs. Game Damn, three. it looks like the frogs are jumping. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> See, this is why you're here, because you're smart. You got that wordplay. <laughs> you call that smart? It then was clever. It was up, really Andy? clever. <laughs> All right. Game three. Yoshis? Oh, will we finally see a different stage? No. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> Unfortunate. All Yo, right, Lodo, and he's making fun of your Marth on stream. <laughs> <laughs> he says it's trash. He said it was gross. Yeah, trash. <laughs> I was going to say just gross. Ooh, but we are getting it. into immediate slobber knocker. Everyone already taking about 40%. And Sonic is not doing too well. Will Lodo be able to close oh, out the stock? He did the runoff instead of the jump first, so he wasn't able to get the height to possibly follow it there. Mm -hmm. Will Sonic be able to turn this around? Ah. Blue team slamming into each other off of that Marth back throw. And it looks like Young Link might be trying to keep the pressure on Marth. Oh, good amount of pressure on Shield, but Lodo able to find his way out. Mm -hmm. Lodo has been playing for too long to fall for a boomerang into a forward air. Crockett, though, dangerously far off stage. Able to make it back, though. They let him be. They tried to double team Lodo, but they both kind of looked a little confused. Ooh, there was a nice down air from Crockett, but he wasn't able to convert, and it's put him in a very bad spot. Blue team taking first blood. Not able to kill Crockett off just yet, though. Mm -hmm. 
Will Crocky be able to end Sonic's career here, or will they keep letting him get away with murder? That down throw is going to kill. That F smash going to kill. And now Red Team has taken the stock advantage. Crockett at 147, just like, I need to live. Ooh, that was a very nice spring from Sonic. But not a, quite enough, able to go into the the stage, so able to live a little bit longer. Crockett is doing a very good job of wasting Blue Team's time when they come to try and deal with him. And Even Lodo. if he's only getting 4 or 5%, that's still helping a lot more. Yep. And Lodo doing a good enough job to at least stay alive when Crockett's put in those positions. Looks like Crockett's trying to play less of the ledge game here and get more aggressive on the ground with these mixtures of bombs and neutral airs. Ah, but it's not, it seems it's not helping too much against Sonic due to the speed of him running and his back air. That dash attack sending in the reverse direction, allowing Lodo to get back onto stage. Surviving at 123. Mm -hmm. This game being a lot more even than the previous one. Oh, oh no! Just a little bit of indecision there. He uh, was like, I want to go back and go over the back air, but he's too far away. Let me uh, float but, back. And, uh, but he returns the favor by knocking out Sonic and gimping a young Link. Ooh, the taunt cancel too. He's feeling himself. And he just... <laughs> Maybe Lodo. he's feeling himself a little too much. <laughs> Lodo, don't jump too high. Frogs can break their legs. All right, Lodo on his last stock. <laughs> but he but you does know have Crockett at three stocks if he needs one himself. That is true. We are technically still even. He's just returning the favor for Sonic running off of that first game. As Crockett has been doing it. Oh, no! <laughs> I really might be a jinx. You need to stop. <laughs> Man, I need to stop saying people are living a long time. All right. Definitely a rough spot for the red team here. Yeah, but they've got Sonic up in the air without a jump. Can he end this? Not, Not quite. Let's him land, and he turns it around very much. Lodo's got to be careful here. He's getting too high in percent, and Marth is not that heavy. Oh my God, that was such a well, good grab. Well, this beat Sonic does have a very strong back throw. Gets the back air. Lodo gonna take the stock. And Crockett, thankfully not too high percent himself. Sonic is at a very easy percent to kill if they can land the hit. So this is very much still doable. Good up smash there, gonna kill Sonic. They have him alone briefly. They need to kill Isildur yep. here. Can they convert? Not uh, quite, not enough. Ooh, but Crockett has actually, him off stage. Can he take advantage of this? Ooh, the turnaround on the boomerang. Actually bad spot for both players. Good up B just before Crockett, Sonic can get the spring. Yeah, great use of the early invincibility on Dark Samus up B. But Youngling coming down very fast with that down air. This is anybody's game here. Ooh. Oh, no. The, no, a very unfortunate SD from Isildur. Not quite able to find the dare. Will Sonic the be able to make anything of this? He has the speed, and everyone is at a dangerous percent. He could do it, especially if Lodo is being as reckless with his swings. No homing Good attack? Good nair. <laughs> I'm seeing a very big lack of homing attack and de spin dash offstage to recover. I'm not sure if this will be helping him or not. Oh, good follow-up on the back air there. An that amazing was... handoff from Lodo to take advantage of the bubble. All right, despite such a bunch of SDs that just kind of happened. Lodo, Florida winning tonight? <laughs> Wait, Lodo, Crockett, stay there. We're going to... Yeah, you guys are going to play next, right? Mm -hmm. You guys are on your way to Losers Finals to play Antoine and Beef.